So for this recipe, you're going to need around about 125 grams of ginger, two lemons, and about 500 mils of water. So what you're going to do first of all is thinly chop the ginger. So this has already been washed. So now I'm just chopping it. It's just a rough chop. The reason you're chopping it like this is so that you don't give your blender too much work to do. So you just slice it roughly like this until it's all done. And obviously make sure you've washed off any dirt that's on it first. So like that. And just finally chop the last bit. There we go. And then you're going to put that into the blender cup. I've got a Nutribullet, so I'm going to put it into the Nutribullet cup. Put that in there. This is a really quick and easy recipe. So I'll put that all in there, put that to one side, and then you're going to juice both the lemons. So all you do, cut them in half, juice them. You can use limes for this as well but obviously lemons is better. So just juice that one and then we're going to put that juice into a separate container. Make sure you get rid of the seeds. So these seeds in here, we're going to pull them back up. make sure because the seeds are not going to help us in any way at all so yeah so once you've done that there's a seed gone there so just make sure you get rid of the seeds as you go along and then you do that with all of the lemons, lemon pieces so that's the first one this is the second a good squeeze so you get that you can do this like this or if you have an electric one that works fine too if you're stuck you can actually just use a fork to juice the lemon in fact i'll show you that method in a moment of how you do that so you put that before that one out so say if you didn't have a lemon squeezer all you'd need to do is go to fork and put it in, get rid of the seed, put it in and turn. Just turn as you go along. Like that, and it kind of basically does the same job. Obviously it doesn't filter out the seeds, you just have to fish them out afterwards. And there, yeah, does the same thing. Right, let me get rid of those seeds. That's the only thing when you do it with the fork, it doesn't get rid of the seeds. But yeah. Um, but you can get rid of them quite easily afterwards anyway, so it's not that big a deal. Yeah, just clean it as I go along. Right, so we've got one more lemon slice. Now, put that to the side, and then you're going to take the chopped ginger, fill up, fill it up with water up to here, which is about the 500 mil, and then you're going to pop this into a blend. You're going to blend this until it's all completely blended and then we're going to strain it. So then you need a bowl and a strainer. 
and then once it's blended I'm going to pour it through the sieve like that and then you're going to use a spoon to get all the juice out just press it through like this and get all that goodness out you could be able to feel when there's no more juice left because as you go like that you'll see nothing coming out anymore give it a good good squeeze All right, then you next add the lemon juice, stir, and then it's ready. So you pour it into a nice glass. and you're ready to serve. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to click the thumbs up, hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you'll see more videos just like this one. Eat good, eat clean, eat blessed. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time, bye.